What's going on YouTube? Today I have the best center build in NHL 24 and a couple of variations. So no matter how you play, please watch this video through to the end. I got some valuable information and some crazy gameplay at the end. To start off, it's a two-way playmaker. That's what I'm calling this build. And we're starting on the two-way forward archetype. All the variations are gonna start from everything I have built out here. So pause the video, copy all this down. I'm not gonna go over it. Just copy this down and let's get straight into version one. The first one is the most balanced. It's the one I'm using in all the gameplays. It's really sick. We're gonna start out by bringing that body checking up to 84 for truculence. It's defensive awareness, stick checking and passing down one notch each. This makes you one of the most completely dominant defensive players on the ice, no matter what. You have six foot four length on your stick along with stick em up. That's a crazy reach, a crazy hog. You should be swinging that thing around like Drake and you can also take the top off of people with truculence and take people out of the game and injure them. It's an amazing ability. Not only that, but you're at 92 speed, 92 excel, which makes you a perfect defender. The next ability, I'm using Big Tipper, but for this variation, you can change up what this next ability is. I, would, I could see elite edges, if you wanna be more puck dominant, make it snap your close quarters for improved shooting, or puck on a string if you're struggling scoring up close. To round this build out, we got a couple of more touches. I'd bring strength up a few. Feel free to take down shot blocking here. Durability, one notch, and hand-eye two. You don't need that crazy of hand-eye because you have Big Tipper. That'll do a lot of the heavy lifting. Shot blocking, you should be point of attack defender. You shouldn't be in front of the net blocking shots with this build. You should be on them, harassing them with your big hog. And durability, you also don't need crazy amounts of because you won't be carrying the puck all the time with this version at least. But with version one out of the way, let's head straight into version two. The first version was more balanced. This one, we're going offensive heavy. For that, I'm using elite edges and close quarters. Two of my favorite offensive abilities in this game. This is if you are the primary puck handler in your team. You could swap out close quarters with something like puck on a string or tape to tape. It all depends on your play style. I'm going with close quarters for now. The second thing I do is bring that agility down two notches, balance up to you don't need crazy agility, you just need to hit that 82 threshold for elite edges and the balance really helps you retain balance as a puck carrier. Next, we're going straight into play style and we are demolishing body checking and down two on defensive awareness just to boost our offensive awareness and our passing a little bit and give a little bit more juice to our stick checking just because we're taking down that body checking. This is the best offensive minded stuff in my opinion you need offensive awareness to be good in the offensive zone it helps you pick up pucks it is amazing receiving passes getting into a shooting position after you catch a pass offensive awareness will help you score a lot more goals it is an incredibly undervalued ability lastly in tenacity we're doing pretty much the same thing we did last time shot blocking down durability down hand eye down and just get that strength up. I love being strong and you need that strength to, to really use your big hog and your six foot four length. Now that we got the second variation down, I think you can guess where the third one is going. We're gonna be going completely defensive minded, an absolute menace of a build. And to kick this build off, of course, we're getting truculence back, but instead of taking any defensive attributes down, we're tanking our offense, but it's gonna be all right. We're still gonna be viable on offense. The, the main focus of this, this variation though is being a complete menace on defense, being a lockdown player, and we got all defense abilities. Stick them up, again with your 6'4", your huge stick, your huge hog, you're gonna be doing crazy plays with that. Truculence, take the top off of people, injure people, all that good stuff, and now you got quick pick, so you can pick off all the passes. With your 6'4 length, this is an absolute menace on the defensive side you will be the best defender on the ice lastly in tenacity you can bring strength up here if you want i'm just gonna leave it as it is you can do whatever you want in there as long as you don't bring durability below 80 because then you lose your boost i'm also juicing up endurance just because you don't need puck control you're not gonna be controlling the puck that much and you can really skate around like a madman and just follow the puck carrier the entire entire game just find who their best player is and follow them it will be a nightmare for them and you will have the best time of your life if you want you could also take balance down a couple notches and up agility just to again improve your defensive capabilities this is the last variation of the best center build in nhl 24 if you use any of these variations please subscribe and like the video it helps out a ton credit for the idea of this build comes from less hockey boys on twitch he rolled up in my chat i also stream live on twitch shameless plug please follow helps out a lot 
he rolled up asked for a build like this i made it it's awesome now it's time to show you the gameplay if you're not completely sold on this build yet watch the gameplay i promise you'll see something you like i hope you enjoy and i'll see you in the gameplay uh, he's not Boy, i did it okay Bobby. gone Someone gone Ooh, that backhand stroke that dude. I'm oh, sorry. I'm oh, sorry. My bad. My bad. Ooh, that backhand stroke that dude. I don't believe that. Can I get a kiss? Oh, Can you make it last forever? Oh, Ooh, that's lit. That's lit. Holy it. shit. Boom! Bro, I can't get a fucking hit to save my life. Logan's failing us right now. Bro, what is that? Oh, oh, that's nasty. Yo. Damn, two on one. Oh, shit. Oh. I'm in a nice neighborhood in Canada with a loving family. Yet I am a thug oh. driven at that nonchalant <laughs> Hoover. In my Hellcat no. stand at 6 4. Oh, 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 oh my god. Uh oh. Not even close. Okay, I'm gonna have to say something to John if you don't get out of here. Is he clap on? Oh, oh, oh. Lock up. The empty net, empty net, empty net, empty net. Yo, what's the play? What's the playoff drop? What's the playoff drop? I don't know. What'd you pass? What'd you pass? Win it back. I'm gonna fly up the left. Uh, a loony flap right. Fuck. Fuck. It don't matter. It don't matter. I can't move. I can't move. I can't move. What just happened? What just happened? Wait, they, just how happened? the f how did that pause? We were mid we were Big mid game pause. How did that even happen? Fuck. He's lying. He's not lagging. He can't like, pause like that. I hope you're. Oh, what? what? Yo, yo, yo! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Wait, what just happened? I'm confused. Oh, cover, cover, cover! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! Do they have to be a top? I think I have to top. Okay, I'll come up for this. Okay. Yeah, come up for it. Come up for it. Oh! Oh! No, you still got. You still got. Shit, bro. Clog the net. Clog the net. Let's clog it. Get that out. Get out. Yes. Lock in. Lock in. Look at the lid. Look at the lid. Look at the lid. Let's go. Oh my god. Bro, I am. Oh, I missed it. How did I miss the net on his tip? That doesn't even make sense. Tip, tip, tip again, tip again. Oh, never mind. Oh, oh, yeah. oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm gonna go. Oh. 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 You want to stole it, too. You want to stole it, but that was nasty. That was gross.